and got cut off. See, this uh, this used to be what's a private enterprise going on. This this guy, see, he's down there. He's emptying the trash, and he is with uh, a subcontractor. We've had Veolia do the trash. Ah, I taught a director of Veolia, which used to be Vivendi Envi Environment, Environment, to speak English for a year in Paris. That was fun. We got along very well. I was offered a nice job there, but the uh, salary I wanted, which was entirely reasonable, um, the, the human resources people said no. He was quite angry about that. You know, I, I already knew his team, and I got along very well with them. And they really liked me. <laughs> and uh, but you know that's a super duper full time job, and requires a tremendous amount of dedication, and uh, many long hours. Possible relocation and everything. You know, no way was I accepting a, a low salary for that. He he quite agreed with me. He absolutely quite agreed with me. He was quite disgusted and disappointed that I couldn't join his team because he had some Americans uh, join and I got along great with them and also the French team it was a, it was a pity but really I'm uh, you know I said that's that's crazy I know your assistant has been relocated with you for years and years many times it's disrupted her life and she puts in long hours and she's terrific and, you know, I'm not doing that for peanuts. <laughs> I was asking for a really reasonable salary, too, by the way. You know, that's how it goes. It was very nice to be asked. But the um, gardening is still done by the city of Saint-Denis, Ville de Saint-Denis. Saint -Denis. And uh, there's a, a nursery and a greenhouse and gardeners and tree surgeons and stuff like that. It's, it's really cool. See, there's an old gate down there at the end of this street. I'm early for an appointment, so I'm hanging out outside. I'm going to go in for a minute because it's pretty cold. This is a taxi phone. That's where they have those little phone cabinets, and you can um, make long-distance calls for cheap. The Internet I really don't like in these places. I used to use that here. I finally got... We finally got the internet at home in 2007. Um, you know, the computers are not very secure, to put it mildly, and it was kind of a hassle. Also, you know, the keyboards are different in other countries. I, when I was in England for a day, I asked to use the couple's uh, computer to email my spouse because my portable phone wasn't working. I hate portable phones, but I do have a very, very old, simple one that I carry with me uh, when I need it. And uh, they seldom work in other countries. Or if they do, you know, the, the roaming fees are, are very, very high. So I wanted to send him an email, and he had a QWERTY keyboard, and uh, I've already relearned touch typing under the Azerty keyboards here, so it was kind of funny. I could barely, I could barely type. <laughs> I had to relearn touch typing here. Okay, I'm going to go in here. That typical gray Paris sky. Kind of gloomy. See you later. Bye.